Good evening friends, Kailash here with Smartphone Tutorials and today we're going to talk about a very controversial topic, unlocking a bootloader on a Xiaomi device. So the first step to unlock a bootloader on a Xiaomi device would be to place a request on the Xiaomi website which is uh, en.miui.com slash unlock. The same is mentioned in the description below. All right. Once you go to that particular website, you will have an option to click on unlock now. And upon clicking unlock now, you will see this particular page. Just fill in all the relevant information and click on apply. Once you have applied you will have to wait for a week or maybe two weeks depending on how long it takes for xiaomi to unlock or grant you the unlock permission and then you will receive a text message which will look like this now that's good news once you've received this text message you know you're just a few steps away from unlocking your phone so what we need to do next is we need to go ahead and download a developer rom now developer roms are available for almost all xiaomi devices and uh, the one you see here, you know, for which the link is mentioned below is for my device. That is the Xiaomi Redmi Note 4. If you're using the same phone, you can definitely go ahead and download this particular file. Or for any other Xiaomi device like the Redmi 3S or maybe the Redmi Note 3, there is a separate link that I've mentioned. You just need to go to that link and click on download. And then you can select your model number and you will be able to download the developer ROM. Now, once the ROM has been downloaded to your computer, just need to connect your phone in USB transfer mode and transfer the ROM to your phone's internal memory. Once the copying is complete, just ensure that you've backed up all your data because this will erase your phone and you have at least 50% of battery. And after that, Go to settings, tap about phone and tap on system updates. Right. Now, once you click on system updates, uh, you will have three radio buttons at the top right hand corner or the menu button. Tap on that and simply click on choose update package. It will open the file manager. Just select the ROM file we just copied. Now you need to be connected to the internet at this point of time on your phone because it will verify the file that we've downloaded and then just hit erase and update or update whatever option you get now this particular install will take five to seven minutes so please be patient once the installation is complete and the phone is booted up don't bother setting it up completely because uh, when we unlock the bootloader it might erase everything on your phone again so in the next step what we're going to do is we're going to go to settings and enable a few things which are essential for unlocking the bootloader so go to settings please go to about phone and then tap on miui version six to seven times now go back one step and go to additional settings and then click on developer options now over here first enable oem unlocking hit ok or confirm and then enable usb debugging and hit ok again all right guys so in the next step we're gonna install minimal adb and fastboot this is a very small file that we'll be installing and uh, what this will do is it'll ensure that the fastboot drivers are installed so that your PC can easily detect your phone in fastboot mode and uh, the unlock can be done. So just download this particular file for which the link is mentioned in the description and uh, go ahead and install it as you see it on the screen. Once the installation is complete, you can just close all the windows. Now in the next step, we will ensure that our device is registered on the Xiaomi servers. So please log in to your My account on your phone and then on your computer. Go to the browser and go to i.my.com.
Now sign in with your MI account details. Now as you can see at the top of the screen, you will see one device connected. In my case it is two. So just click on that to ensure that your MI device is connected. And then click on find device. Once your device is located, you can go ahead and click on the noise option just to ensure that your phone rings and it is communicating with the MI service properly. Once all these operations are completed successfully, you can go ahead and close this window. We'll first boot the phone into fast boot mode. And to do that, power off your device as seen on the screen. And then press and hold the volume down and power button together for four to five seconds till you see the fast boot sign on your screen. Once the phone is in fast boot mode, you can keep it aside and download the MI Unlock tool using WinRAR or WinZip you can extract it to your desktop and then open the My Unlock tool folder. Right click on the My Unlock tool icon and open it under Administrator Privileges or basically an elevated privilege. Now over here, you need to log in using your mobile number. So if you're from India, plus 91 and then your mobile number and your password for your My Account. The same account for which you received the permission to unlock and then go ahead and sign into your My Unlock tool. Now once the tool has verified that you have unlocking permission for this particular My Account, it will take you to a screen wherein it tells you to connect the phone. So just connect the phone to your computer and then simply hit unlock. Now this is the stage where a lot of people have been facing issues like, you know, they get stuck at 50% couldn't verify device or the connected device is different from the computer and stuff like that. There, there have been several errors that have been, you know, troubling people a lot. Now, I have found a very small workaround for it and uh, you know I'm willing to help everyone but for that uh, I would like uh, to request you guys to comment in the section uh, in the comment section below and let me know what problem you're facing so that I can guide you. Uh, basically I have one MI account and I have been able to unlock three different devices using that one MI account in a single day. So, you know, if nothing works for you, maybe you can use my account to go ahead and unlock your device. I am definitely willing to do that. And that's about unlocking a bootloader on a Xiaomi device. So if you liked the video, please like, share and subscribe. To